How to grow Moringa plant at home Moringa olifera is also called the drumstick tree or the miracle tree. Moringa is known for its medicinal and health benefits as it has antifungal, anti-inflammatory, antiviral and antidepressant properties. Moringa or drumsticks have been used in India for centuries but the world now calls it not a miracle herb but superfood. The leaves of Moringa plant are powdered and added to tea and coffee to be used in many classic recipes of main dishes and condiment. It also can be used in chapatis, dals or sabzis. The benefits of this plant has made it known as a health food. So let us see how we grow Moringa plant at home, how to grow it from seeds and how to transplant it. This is three month old sapling which we transplanted on 11th of April and then we had the first trim on 18th of July and you can see it till 18th of August what is the progress. This is the same tree that we trimmed one month ago. That was on July 18th. Today is 18th of August. You can see the new shoots that have grown. I had two saplings. This one is the first one. And this one is the second one. This one has not really grown that much in that one month. But then it depends from sapling to sapling. See how tall it has grown in 6 months. We had to trim it. So you can see the top portion of it. You can see the chopped off top portion. So we chopped off about 1.5 to 2 feet. And that was basically to allow the new shoots to be formed from underneath. So you can see this is 15 days later. You can see the new shoots coming up. And it has grown really really tall. I have two saplings of this which grew about 8 to 10 feet tall. When we trim the moringa tree, do not throw the leaves. The leaves can be used for making a powder of it or you can make moringa soup or you can make moringa vegetable. There are many ways in which you can use the leaves. They are all having good health benefits. The next trimming for our plants will be after a year. So next monsoon, I will be trimming them for the second tree. So it will grow a little wider because it is still in the big pot on my terrace. Hopefully it should start flowering and fruiting soon because even the drumsticks and the flowers of Baringa plant, they have good health benefits. So you see how easy it is to plant drumstick seeds, get the saplings and then transplant them to grow into such big sturdy plants and plus you will see there are so many health benefits you can use even the drumsticks powder in your chapatis in your dals your sabjis you can put them in your dosa batter 
just a little bit. So you see, it is very easy to grow moringa plant in your house. Try it out. You should start planting seeds sometime in January. So by the time it is monsoon, they will have grown sufficiently big to transplant. And then later on in the month of August, September, it can go for its first string. And later on, after six months or one year, second string. I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.